seasons now, we're in spring and we're nearly in summer, scarily. I decided that I would do, you know, a kind of seasonal clothing haul. I say that, but when you do clothing hauls, they always tend to be seasonal anyway because I don't often purchase things from, you know, the wrong season than the one you were in because what would, what would be the point in that? Anyway, today's clothing haul is from boohoo.com. They do free returns, so I thought if anything that comes in it's really crap quality, I don't buy and I don't like it, I can always send it back and it's free. But I'm so impressed, like I can't even like begin to explain how happy I am with literally 90% of what I ordered. So I have one big box, which looks like this. And then I have a big bag <laughs> and a slightly smaller bag. But yeah, let's get into it. So might as well just start off with what I'm wearing. So basically it is this um, kind of raglan style skater dress. I've never really been a fan of skater dresses, but at least not for quite a few years. I used to wear them like in my younger teen years, but um, not more recently, I just haven't liked them. But I saw this one on the website, um, and as you can see, it's grey with white sleeves, and then it's just kind of like a, a mini length. But I saw it on the website, and I thought I just really liked it, and I kept on going back to the page and being like, hmm, and I just really, really liked it, so I decided to buy it. So next, I'll go to the box, <laughs> the box of goodies. Now, um, I actually got the box because I brought a hat and they sent it in a box, obviously, to um, keep it from getting squashed throughout transit. Um, I was really happy with this for a start because I was really worried about buying the hat and then it arriving and then it being really squashed or whatever, but it's not because they sent it in this box and it's fabulous. I wanted one of these hats for a very long time now and then they've just started coming in fashion, like, everywhere. And uh, when I was on the Boohoo website, I thought, oh, I'll have a look just in case. I wasn't expecting to find one. And I did. And I'm. Da, da, da. It's a boater hat. And oh my god, I'm in love with it. I just love it. <laughs> I just love it. I think it's adorable. And I think it looks so nice for holiday or just in summer in general. You know, for like little garden parties. And oh, I just think it's adorable. I really do so like it. But um, I love this little bow bit here. Some of them didn't have the bow, they just had like the um, ribbon, but no bow, but I wanted the kind of really traditional bow, because I feel like I'm, um, you know, on the back of a um, one of them long boats in, in Italy, like rowing and singing, um, that's amore, or something. And there, I just love it. So next, I'm going to move on to um, a dress, actually, which I got in the sale, right? For three pounds, three pounds, okay? And um, it's a like slip dress, and I've wanted a slip dress for a long while. Um, because they're just so simple, and you just, you know, like, they look good, but they're, you know, you, you can put it on with a pair of heels, and it looks like you made an effort, but you've actually not, you just shook that on. Like, it doesn't take much to make it look good. The colour is a bit garish, but, oh my God, I love it. Look, I love it. It's this like gorgeous, bright pink corally colour. I don't know how it would look on camera as comparison to how it looks in person. It is very bright and garish and daring. But yeah, and I'm actually really surprised by the quality. I thought the quality was going to be horrible, like a really thin silk, but it's not. It's it's really not thin, so it's not going to be see through. It's a nice, not heavy, but uh, kind of a bit more heavy duty, which is good because it means it won't be blowing up in the wind when you see underwear and everything. But I love it. That absolute bargain, like bargain.com.co.uk forward slash I'm winning. So next, I might as well move on to another thing that I got for my birthday. Now this is for my birthday night, like my main outfit. I think, anyway, I think I'm gonna wear this on my birthday night and then the other one on the Saturday after my birthday, although I might change it. This is on my hanger because I um, I already, I got this in a previous order, which is this two-piece um, camel set. I've, I've seen these everywhere and I've really, really wanted one. And then I owned it on for ages over the colours. There were so many different colours to choose from. I ordered it in a khaki and a black and a camel to see which one I thought I'd, I'd like best. Um, I've still got the black one here. I'll show you that one in a minute. Um, but I returned the khaki one and then a, a jumpsuit, like I say. But I think this is the one I'm going to keep. I'm not too sure yet, but it's got the knotted front um, bit here and it comes up just under your boobs, but it really, it clings really nicely. It's a little bit tight. 
pot. But it's, it's really nice and it's a crepe material. Again with this I was worried that the quality would be really bad but it's not at all, it's a nice crepe. Um, it, evidently, you know, like, to, to be honest, for the price, it, the material is better than I thought it would be. Um, if anything, I could have done with an eight in the top, but you buy them as a set, so I, I got the six. And it's fine, it does fit fine. I might just have to, you know, breathe in a bit. But... Why, when I decide to film, do all the airplanes in the world decide to fly over my house? So just to quickly show you the black version. It's exactly the same, but just in black. So these are the um, like Blase pants. You know, I've even contemplated keeping this one as well because I think I'd still get a lot of wear out of it. Actually, I did. The only one thing I will say is I ordered the brown one and the black one together. And when I first ordered it, they sent me another khaki one instead. So I had to email them saying, um, you've sent me a khaki one, not a black one. So then they had to send me a black one. So then I had two khaki ones, a camel one and then a black one. So next, moving on to some more summery items, um, which I've actually brought like from a holiday or for some time. And yes, um, there's kind of a running theme here. Aztec is one of them prints that I've, you know, I've loved, I've hated, I've loved, I've hated, I've gravitated towards, and then I've been like, that's disgusting. Or, you know, it's changed a lot over the years. But I'm in the phase of loving it again. But I brought four, three dresses and a jumpsuit. So, yes. The first one is this, actually, this isn't so much Aztec, this is just kind of like florally boho. We'll say boho, not Aztec, um, because they vary. But this, I'm in love with. It's this kind of milkmaid, I'm going to call it, dress. Like a midi length um, dress. And the sleeves are kind of puffy, and then they like tighten around the wrist. So they're just, um, it's like a gypsy dress a bit. Um, you know, the gypsy gypsy style tops and dresses and stuff is like very in at the moment, especially for all the festivals and things. Like festival season, that kind of thing is always in obviously, but gypsy tops have been everywhere this year. And then you've got this bit, and this is the bit that I love. It's like, it's hard to describe because you can't show it very well on camera, but it's like a V-neck um, little bit here, which plunges a bit, so it's a little bit booby. But then there's these two little ties with little beads on it, and you can tie them um, across like that. And then it like covers it quite nicely. So it's nice if you if you want to like if you're going out on a cute little summer date and you want to be a little sexy, or if you're going out with a family and you want to be a bit more you know conservative. Um, is that the word? I don't think that's the word. Is that just the political party? I don't know. Hopefully you'll see this in some kind of summer lookbook or something because I can't wait to wear this in an outfit, especially on holiday or something. Mm. Next we're moving on to another dress, and this is another one that I'm absolutely in love with. Now. I'm not really sure yet as to wear this with a belt or not because, <coughs> excuse me, it's like a midi dress but it's loose um, and I'm not sure whether I get away with that having a petite figure. I think I might have a wear a belt around the middle to like stitch it in. But basically it is this, it's very African Aztec print and um, it's just a silky material. It's quite thin so I would possibly wear this over the top of a um, thin like cami dress, like a black cami dress, or even, you could even wear this on a beach or something, but right now it's new and it's lovely and so I'd, I'd probably wear it out a few times first and then maybe towards the end of your holiday or something, or towards the end of the summer you could wear it like over a bikini on beach or, you know, more, more casual, but I just love it. The print is like just delicious and it's all these um, kind of, what's the word? Um, the colours. Next I brought a jumpsuit. Now this uh, I really do love. I really do love it. It's like an asymmetric um, again Aztec print jumpsuit and I think this might possibly be my airport outfit. I'm not really sure yet but uh, it looks like this. So you've got the, the straps here which are nice because they're quite thick and then this kind of asymmetric, asymmetric bit across the front and then it goes asymmetric down the neck here um, and then I don't think it's meant to be I think it's meant to be on your shoulders but you also could have it like Bardo with one shoulder um, because I tried that and it wasn't <laughs> so you couldn't do it like that um, yes cinch it away just again here and it goes down goes down goes down and the ends are just loose like it's not um, elasticated and again really nice quality like I, I, I'm very surprised by the quality of all these products to be honest. This is the last in my boho -y, floral -y kind of range. Um, this is another dress. Again, I love it. 
and again, I don't know what the word is about. It's a smock dress and it's got this gorgeous, gorgeous florally colourful, very colourful prints on it. Um, I think it's very vintage. You know, the paisley print on it, it is very vintage as you see down the this here. Um, it's got this little collar which is what kind of drew me to it as well. And then they're kind of um, pleated down here or they go all the way down to here, midway of the dress. I really like it. So, you know. So next I bought this which is another grey dress. I don't need any more grey clothes, I have a lot. Basically it's a midi dress, a darling, um, and it's just a loose kind of t-shirty dress, but unfortunately I don't really like it. I'm not in love with it and I don't want to keep it if I'm not in love with it because I won't get the wear out of it. I don't know if I'm not such a big fan because I got it in a size 10. They only had the grey one in a size 10 and up and uh, I probably could have done with it in a 6 or an 8. So um, I don't know, maybe I'll go on and see if they've got any more now because it probably was like over a week ago when I ordered it and might have some more in stock. Or maybe I'll order another colour because the potential of this dress is really nice. Now, another thing I brought was a hat. I've wanted a visor for a while. In fact, I've wanted a visor for like over a year. I nearly brought one last summer from M&S but they weren't like in fashion then. I really wanted one but they weren't like in style so I thought if I get one I'll probably look like an old granny. So I didn't buy one. But this year, they're dead in fashion. So I brought this one, which is from Boohoo, um, but it's really big and it just looks a bit odd. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I think I just look like I'm gonna go pay golf or something. But it was literally like four pound or something ridiculously cheap. So yeah, if you can tell, now I'm kind of getting into the things that I'm probably gonna return side of things. So I got this polo shirt um, and it's got this really, really nice, kind of striped print, I think it's very retro, and then like the zip up, or what? The zip just up here, and the collar. I looked this on the website, but I was really sad when it arrived because it's crepe, um, or, or, or like a woven material, and I just don't like it. I thought it was gonna be cotton, I thought it was gonna be like a polo shirt. And then the last thing I brought, which I am also returning, was a pair of jeans. On the website they just look so delicious, but just in person, when they were on me, I was just like, they, they don't suit me. They are all of these. Now they're like a relaxed boyfriend jean with these uh, pleather patches on them here. And down at the bottom here, I actually rolled them up, so let me roll them back down. The potential of these jeans was very strong and I loved them on the website. And they were in the sale, I think I got them for like £10 or something. Um, but they arrived and I tried them on and I just, I was just like, mm, no. If they didn't have this leather patch here, this leather panel, I'd like them more. It just looked weird. It, did, it just didn't look like it was meant to be there. It looked like I'd ripped a massive hole and just had to replace it with leather because it was the only material that I had. I wasn't a fan of them on, but the style is really nice. The boyfriend's jean style, the wash of the denim is lovely and I like the ripped bits, but just the leather, you know, wasn't really wasn't really doing it for me. So that is everything today for my haul video, I think. I hope you enjoyed it. I've not done one of these for a while. Um, oh, well, I've never done a boo haul, but I've never, I've not ever, no, hmm, I've not done a haul for a while. And like I say, coming into the new seasons now, I thought it was somewhat, I'm gonna put this on. So yeah, that is, that is everything. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up if you did. Subscribe if you haven't already. And comment below if you forgot to see. Yeah. And I'll see you soon. Bye!